2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. And you can tell it's the playoffs by the atmosphere in this locker room. Guys trying to stay loose, but there's a serious focus, a serious undertone. That's a look at our setting tonight, the picturesque city of Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Round one of the East rolls on. Game two, just about ready to tip off. Playoff basketball on 2K Sports. With Greg Anthony and Chris Weber, this is Kevin Harlan. David Aldrich will be reporting from the sidelines. Hey, Dave. Kevin, thanks. Ben Simmons' shooting has always been a topic of concern since he came into the league. Doc Rivers said, I don't want him to play thinking about shooting a jump shot. I want him to play downhill, get in the paint, make plays, and get to the free throw line. He's a great player. I'm going to give him the keys and let him be free. Guys? <laughs> Good idea. Thank you, DA. Now a look at Philadelphia's starting lineup. Outside the wings are Curry and Green. The stars of this team in the post, Harris and Embiid. And it's Maxi in at the point. And for Milwaukee. The wingmen, DiVincenzo and Middleton. The big men on the floor, Giannis and Lopez. And it's Holiday in at the point guard position. So Philadelphia will get the first possession. Now, here's Maxi. And here's Embiid. Got that bucket. Embiid's got the scoreboard going with his first points of the night for Philadelphia. What a baller this guy is. The big fella, Embiid. I mean, he welcomes getting physical and overwhelms the defense with his size and muscle. Knocked away. It's stolen by Green. He's looking for Embiid and finds him. And Embiid throws it down. That's the savvy veteran Green. He's able to spot when his teammates aren't being covered. That's a nice read right there. Holiday with it. Middleton looking it over to the inside. Here's DiVincenzo. And they call an illegal screen here. Yeah, quick foul to pick up right away here in the first quarter. And here's Green. He'll bring it up for Philadelphia. Four-point game. And just over a minute played here in the start of the game. Harris against Antetokounmpo. Harris's shot is good. Uh, the dribbling maneuvering of Harris. I mean, just an absolute genius with the ball in his hands. Middleton on the wing. Let's the free fly. Oh, and he almost had a four-point play right there. He'll go to the line with a chance for three. That's his first personal foul. Yeah, he, there was definitely some contact there on the three-point attempt. The Bucks shooting their first free throws of the night right here. Chris Middleton. At the line for three. And that one falls for Middleton. And really, from second-round pick to all-star, Middleton's story inspirational. Yet even now, it feels like some people continue to sleep on him. Good on the second free throw. third 
Oh, you can get spoiled watching him at the line. I mean, you just expect him to make every one, every time. Curry kicks to Harris. Now, here's Maxi. He's guarded close. Out to Harris. Lock at six. Three-pointer. Even Genzo with the rebound. Here in the first quarter with about two minutes gone by. At Giannis. There's the triple. And Devin Shinzo is good for three. And that makes it a tie ball game. And I'll tell you, after the Kumpos, he falls into one of the better passing forwards in our league. And when the defense is focused on you that much, you need to be able to find the open man. Here's DiVincenzo. Lays it up and banks it in. DiVincenzo's got five now. The 76ers have gone three of four from the field to start out the game. Pass to Embiid. Over Lopez. That one is good from Joel Embiid. He has six. And the touch Embiid has on his jumper, I mean, looking so soft and accurate, coming out of his hands. The pass to DiVincenzo. And here's Middleton. On his left side. Five to shoot. Pass to DiVincenzo. Shoots over Curry. DiVincenzo can't hit it. Oh, you expect him to make those. They've got to do more to get a hand in his face next time. And Embiid throws it down. Did you see the no-look pass by Harris right there? I mean, he's a wing that knows how to move the ball. Holiday finds DiVincenzo. Hooked away. Here's Antetokounmpo. One up, one down. Two points with his first shot this game. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Yeah, very little resistance. I mean, he had to bring much faster help than that. Curry, good. That off Curry. the catch. Curry can be automatic. I mean, he never second guesses his selection at all. Holiday, the pass to Lopez. Passes it to Andre Kumbo. Over Harris. That shot missing. Now the 76ers take it the other way. The results in their game on Sunday left no doubt. And sometimes it's a lot harder to get easy looks on the road. But they found ways to get their guys good looks. And, and, and a lot of it is moving without the ball. When you do that, things tend to open up. Here's DiVincenzo. After the made shot from Joel Embiid. Middleton can't get it to go. And you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. Curry passes to Embiid. Back to Curry. Out of bounds. Milwaukee takes possession. Here's Holiday shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Great speed and tricks on the drive. Holiday excels at putting defenses in those compromising positions. And a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for the 76ers. Well, they've carried out a great game plan in the paint so far, working it down low a lot and getting high percentage looks. Also, guys, the passing has been terrific in the first half. They'll be happy with all those assists. And the first one drops. It definitely has the respect of the locker room. Holiday is someone that players enjoy playing with. Good on both. Here's Curry. Pass to Harris. Dishes it to Embiid. And the foul on Drew Holiday. That's his first foul. His first personal foul. First team foul. Now, here's 
here's Maxi. Defended by Middleton. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Chris Middleton. That's his first foul. I mean, I like the call. I thought the defense was just there a little late. Here's MB. He's got 10. Philadelphia moving the ball around. And there's the pass to Curry. On the wing, Harris. Just five on the clock. Pass to Embiid. Pulls up on the wing. And when Lopez is locked in on defense, it helps. I mean, look, you'd love to see this one. Loads it up for Giannis. Hammers the alley through. And if you're looking to make a big play with the pass, you've got to love Giannis. He's a big target on those alley oop lobs. Maxi passes to Embiid. the three. Rebound Giannis and the Kumbo. For Milwaukee, they've gone 4-7 from the field, shooting over 50%. Pass to Holiday. Pass to Middleton. It's good. The assist that time from Holiday. Middleton's got five now. And this is something Middleton's improved over time, converting through contact. And the pass to Curry. Here is outside. They get it again. The Bucks have gone five of eight from the field, shooting over 62%. Anthony Jacobo can't get it to go. 76ers trailing. Now, here's Maxi. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. He kicks it to Harris. To end the cold streak. Good on the triple. And the 76ers lead by one. Now he's improving from distance. Now that's one of the things Harris has worked on. And the work has paid off. Middleton the pass to Lopez. the Kumbo against Harris. And they pick up two. Giannis has got his third basket of the night right there. And he's having quite the quarter converting at a really high percentage. And the 76ers decide to take their first time out here. Completely new group here for Philadelphia. Simmons left side. That's tipped. Pass to Drummond. Five on the clock. On the wing, Milton. Another miss by Philadelphia. And here's Giannis. He'll bring it up for the Bucks. Here's Nora. And the shot is long. Philadelphia's gone. Just one of four from three-point range here in the first. In the pass to Niang. Now Giannis. He has six. Milton grabs the board. A fantastic effort on D to get up in his face and deny the layup. He had Simmons atop the key. Passes to the A. Now, here's Fiber. Here's Simmons. 
from deep three-point range. Rebounded by the Bucks. Here's Norlin. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Here's Giannis. That's in, and that's his fourth yeah. basket of the night. He's taking seven shots, a solid 57%. And I really marvel at the touch of Antetokounmpo for his size and physique. That's incredible. That one goes. Count it. And really, it's been a major aspect of their offense in the early stages here. Their success working the ball inside and getting points from close range. Now here's Hood, Aston Morrow, and stolen by Thibel. Drummond trying to get himself free, and that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Way to play in attack mode and get to the line. And a chance for this to second now to check out the scoring breakdown for the Bucks. Well, they're just a team in sync right now. Their passing in the first half has been outstanding. And also defensively, they've been able to cause some turnovers they're tonight. Great. And, and that also builds Good confidence shot. and gives you momentum. That free throw missing. Probably a little draft in the arena tonight. He's the last guy you expect to miss the mark by that much. Absolutely. He's off on the second. For Milwaukee, they've gone 7 to 13, just over 50% from the floor. Some good looks. Holiday, the pass to Mora. They get a hand on it. And now Philadelphia on the break. Some nice ball movement here by the 76ers. And they take the lead. And the 76ers lead by one. Well, almost impossible to keep Drummond from scoring inside, no matter how physical you get with him. And Holiday kicks to Hood. And again, the turnover by the Bucks. 76ers ball. Allen's checked in for Andre Takumbo. Grayson Allen. One fifty-six left to play in the first. Here's Milton, and it's in there. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Simmons against Holiday. The pass to Allen. 131 left in the first quarter. Shot clock at five. There's Portis. Puts the fade away right on the money. I'll tell you what, I'm not sure these guys can keep this up. Yeah, and so far, both teams have been outstanding at the offensive end. A lot of game left to play. And that one's good. Drummond. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Outside Holiday. Makes it off the glass. A really smart player. Holiday can find the spaces inside and exploit them for points. Now, here's Milton. Aston Yang. The dish to Simmons. Unloads from 13. That one a tad offline to the right, but drops in for him. What focus from the young guard. I like how Simmons stayed locked in on scoring despite the contact. Allen left side. The 15-footer. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. Now look, even if he had other places to go with the ball, that's a good shot. You can't blame him for letting that one Here's Milton. Sweet little floater. And it's a 5.76ers lead. And so Holiday will bring it up for the Milwaukee Bucks. Launches a three. That shot misses. 
A big-time effort for Joel Embiid, providing a lot of energy for the Philadelphia 76ers. He got into double digits for the quarter with 10 points total. And don't go away. We'll be right back. And as we know, the great ones make those around them better. That's certainly the case with Giannis Antetokounmpo. I'm a lot more comfortable. Uh, it's because my teammates trust me, my team trusts me to make the right play. And, you know, lately, late uh, in the game, I am just try to make the right play. That can be a pass. Uh, that can be a shot. But that's my mindset down the stretch. Hmm, not predetermined. He's reading the defense and then responding accordingly. Well, it, it starts with getting downhill. The, the defense has to build a wall to keep him away from the rim. And glad to have you with us as we get going here in game two. And looking at what we've seen so far, guys, from the 76ers, what are your thoughts? I mean, offensively, I thought they did a good job of protecting the ball. And defensively, boy, were they disrupted. Great balance of efficiency and intensity, which is why they hold the early lead. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups, courtesy of Gatorade, as the second quarter gets going. And Milwaukee, looking at who they've got. We've got Hood. Portis is out there with Allen. And it's Connaughton in it with the shooting guard. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. His first personal foul. The Bucks have been good at the line so far. Five of five. At the line for Milwaukee, Jordan Mora. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. The 76ers leading by five. Simmons looking around. Milton in the corner. Shot clock at six. It's in and he's a very efficient five for six on the game. Yeah, these defenders just look a bit overmatched, especially inside. Allen outside. at Chikonitzen. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. Here's Hood driving inside. They get it back. Mora, the pass to Portis. And another shot. And stolen by Portis. And here's Hood. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Pass to Allen. Clock at four, and the layup's good off the glass. And despite the size disadvantage, attacking the heart of that defense. Yeah, very aggressive. I mean, he takes on the challenge with no hesitation. Now here's Simmons. That's it. He's got two made now, and he's shooting two for three. Oh, great production on the interior right now. Eight straight from inside. Second quarter of play with almost three minutes gone. So both teams making some changes here. Second team foul. Coming out of the floor for the 76ers. We have got to see that sensational mobile one block again. Well, they didn't make it this far by giving up easy ones. And now their defense is in overdrive. Allen 
with it. And he drops in the layup off the glass. I mean, the number of points they've scored in the paint already here is eye open. The 76ers leading by five. Harris outside. Up top, Curry. Let's go. And he wills that one in. Sinking right through off the back eye. Harris. The Bucs have gone just two of eight shooting here in the second quarter. The pass to DiVincenzo. From the arc. A shot missing. And it's Philadelphia the other way. Here's Green. And a great assist by Curry as that one goes in. Green's got the lead up to nine now for the 76ers. Now here's Allen. Middleton outside. Poked loose. Embiid with it. Now guarded by Middleton. Embiid, no good. And so Allen will bring it up for the Bucks. And there's the drive. Lopez outside. Middleton against Green. Six on the shot clock. Right at the free throw line. And all around the win that time before dropping in. Middleton's got seven points in the game. Now, here's Maxi, defended by Allen. Outside curve. Fades and shoots. And bead, no good. There's a lesson for you. Don't show ball. Tries to get fancy with the fadeaway, <laughs> and it backfires. Middleton finds Allen. Here's DiVincenzo. Here's Lopez, and again, it's Milwaukee converting. And really, Lopez has been dangerous to get throughout his career. You gotta guard him closely. Pass to MB. Out to Harris. Back to MB. Has contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. That's his second personal. And they've had assists now on their last three baskets. And he's got his first chance at the line here. The Bucks making a switch here. That's the Kumbos checked in. And Embiid, no good on that one. Is there a more entertaining player in this league than Joel Embiid? I mean, on the court, he's a seven-plus footer who can do it all. Off the court, no one better on social media. And it goes down two points. Nice job creating for the easy deuce. Philadelphia leading by five. Here's Max. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Curry kicks to Harris. the basket. All right, it's been absolutely amazing to watch Harris mature. I mean, physically, he can handle the power. Here's Connaughton, guarded by Green. Now, DiVincenzo. He's got five. Giannis, right side. And onto Takumbo, screams it in. And that move has become second nature for Giannis. Once he establishes position, game over. And here's Maxi. Here's Embiid running close again, Philadelphia. Embiid. They have ridden him today, and it has paid off in a big way. Connington kicks to Lopez. Even Shenzo with it. He's looking for Giannis and finds him. Giannis is double. Here's Connaughton. Oh, and that one had the right spin on it, and it is good. Connaughton's got four points in the quarter. The 76ers leading by five. Now, here's Maxi. And Curry has it in the corner. 
Nails the wide open jump shot. Curry's got six. Milwaukee's gone 0-2 from deep here in the second. Middleton outside. And to the Kumbo inside. He's got 10. Shots good by Middleton. And that's why Middleton got that giant extension. He can stretch the floor. Philadelphia shooting has been just uncontainable. 72%. Passes it through Embiid to the paint. Here's Harris. It's good. Nine points in the game so far. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. And Milwaukee calls their first time out of the game. Well, it's been an express lane to the rim. Coach can't be happy about that. Poor rotations. I mean, slow help. There's just not enough toughness on the interior. They've got a lot to talk about. in for the 76ers. Pass to DiVincenzo. Giannis with it. That's the sixth make from the field. He's taken nine shots and missed but three. And we talk about Antetokounmpo's all-around skills, and tonight it's been about the scoring. He's put this offense on his back. Niang passes to Maxi. Six to shoot. Good for the basket. Starting off one for one with that shot. And I like that they're not settling. Getting the ball on the interior. Eight of their last ten coming that way. Here's Giannis. Tipped away. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Ana Dacumbo. Ben Simmons, he's checked in for the 76ers. Ben Simmons. Philadelphia leading by six. And the foul on Drew Howard. That'll be his second foul of the game. That's number two for him already. A third foul before the half, and he may be grabbing some time. Embiid, the pass to Harris. Outside, Simmons. Now the pass to Curry. Takes the three. And the rebound goes to Lopez. Milwaukee has gone one of three from way outside since the start of the second quarter. Middleton can't get it to go. Man, you don't see this fella blow many there. Not against D like that. Here's Simmons. Count the bucket. And he's got a free throw coming up as well. That's again and ball. again, they're dissecting the defense and creating those high percentage looks from inside. For the First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. Woods checked in for Lopez. And Philadelphia also making a switch. Andre Drummond's checked in for Joel Embiid. Misses for Simmons. But well, we're growing up in Australia. Ben Simmons played lots of Australian rules football. When you watch him play, that's the toughest you see. Yeah, nice, silky finish on the alley from 
a stupendous feed. That sequence couldn't have been executed any better. Curry gets to Niang. He dishes it to Simmons. And Simmons slams it in. This is why you must get Simmons out the paint because he's fantastic when it comes to dunking. Now the feed to Middleton. And a beautiful feed leads to a monster jam. Strong move to the 10, trying to get his guys going. Hard not to get motivated, GA, right when your teammate makes that kind of play. They need a match, and I love the consistent setup for the lane. Out to Harris. From deep. Milwaukee with the rebound. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. Now here's Hood. He's still scoreless so far in this one. From eight, he gets it in there. Now just a 4.76ers lead. I thought maybe the D would figure him out as the game went along. It looks like he's figured them out in this first half. Pass to Curry. Outside, Simmons. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. And one area where they've improved here in the second quarter is getting the ball in the paint. That inside scoring has gotten much stronger. He's 0 of 1 from the line, missing on his first trip. Milwaukee making a switch here. Wara checked in. Matisse Thibault checked in for Philadelphia. Shake Milton comes in for Curry. That one misses for Simmons. Bucks trail by six. Aston Moore. Good, and the assist goes to Giannis. Giannis has got four assists in the game. That's just the product of good pass work. I mean, nice team basketball. Now here's Simmons. Ten points for him. There's 47 seconds left to play in the first half. And they double up Simmons. Just four to shoot. Here's Milton. 18 that time from Hood. Milwaukee's gone one of three from way outside since the start of the second quarter. Out of bounds. It'll be 76ers ball. Reedy's checked in for George Niang. Thirty-two seconds left in the first half of the game. The drive by Simmons, and that one good. Simmons got twelve points in the game. Yeah, they've gone away from the triple as they look to protect this lead. Giannis passes to DiVincenzo. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. Pass to Antetokounmpo. Just five to shoot. There's the pass to Moore. And another three for Milwaukee. And how about the splendid four vision from Antetokounmpo? A good decision maker improves his passing each and every year. And that's it for the first half of action. What's been a very close game here. 76ers lead by three. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much, Doc. A high-scoring affair in the first half. Did you think coming in that it would be this kind of shootout? Not at all. But we're not playing good enough defense to guard anybody. So, you know, we just got to play better day, keep the ball in front of us. Doc, thanks for your time. Back to you guys. Thank you, David, for that interview. And we'll see you back here after the break for third-quarter basketball. It doesn't get much better than playoff basketball. Let's get back to the action here in round one. Joel Embiid has been sensational. Man, he's been running wild on him through that first half. Absolute dynamite on offense. And, and as they can't slow him down, you know what you do? You keep feeding them and feeding them and feeding them. This is the right game plan. NBA playoffs round one. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action on the court. And so in the game for the 76ers, down on the block, it's Harris and MB. Outside the wings are Curry and Green. And it's Maxi in at the one. 
On the wing, Di Vincenzo. Guarded by Kerr. They get it back. Embiid against Hood. Now here's Lopez. He's covered closely. And here's Di Vincenzo from the arc. At the clock winding down and rattles out the dunk. You know, the layup might have been a better shot for him. Here's Maxi. And the three ball is good. Maxi's got five points so far. Really well done there. Just confident and composed. Never in a hurry. And about a minute of action so far in the third quarter. Onto the Kumbo looking it over. For three, Middleton. Good. And it's Giannis picking up the assist. Giannis has got six assists here tonight. Now, here's Maxi. And by Hood. He takes it in. Maxi, no good. I wonder what the score would be if they weren't controlling the backboard. Got a piece of it. It's stolen by Green. Shoots the three. Rebounded by the Bucks. Andre the Kumbo's got double digit rebounds now in the game. Middleton the pass to Andre the Kumbo. Back to Middleton. And again, Milwaukee with the triple. Defensively, they just look out of sync, not closing out on the threes in time. And it's the 76ers with the ball. Here's Max. He has five. And B trying to break loose. And that one's good. Maxi. Maxi's got his third basket of the night. And so it'll bring it up for the Milwaukee Bucks. Trailing by two. Pass to Middleton for the lead. And another three for Milwaukee. And this is the game plan for him. He's a big part of their floor space. Hitting from range on a consistent basis, it makes everything easier offensively. And it's Green missing. Milwaukee has gotten going here in the second half from outside, nailing three of four from the arc, and it's good for two. Three minutes gone now in the third quarter. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. Murray finds Harris, lets it go from deep. Maxi, no good. And the Bucks with possession. They're on an 11-2 run. Lopez passes to Middleton. Shoots a fader, and there are the Bucks with another bucket. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. In the third quarter with just over three and a half minutes off the clock. Driving to the basket. The 76ers with another miss. Credit to Deep for not giving up on that play. He's a tough cover that ball. Here's DiVincenzo. To the middle. That shot off. Now the 76ers take it the other way. This quarter has been hit or miss for him. Mostly miss. He passes to Harris. Takes the bucket. Now he's got five field goals, five for eight in the game. Well, well throughout Harris's career, he's worked on building up his body, putting that added strength to good use on these tough finishes. Timeout called the Bucks. Well, their goal was to limit their turnovers, I and mean, they've wasted way too many possessions with giveaways.
substitution here for Milwaukee. Portis, he's checked in for Giannis Antetokounmpo. Pat Connaughton comes in for Chris Middleton. Grayson Allen's checked in for Dante DiVincenzo. And it's Drew Holiday in for Hood. Now Holiday gets the bucket and the foul. That one on Harris. Mostly through contact. Holiday has the strength and body control to do it. And a chance to catch up on some numbers of scoring breakdown for Milwaukee. If you want to see how efficient the offense is running? A great stat to look at is points off assist. And they've gotten a ton of assists throughout this game. And how about their post play? I mean, they're getting good offensive execution on the low block. That free throw good from Drew Holiday. The 76ers trail by six. And here's Maxi. He's got seven. Curry is inside. Defended by Allen. And there's the whistle on the shot. Took the foul. Shot misses. He'll be shooting two. Way to attack there and then create the contact. Philadelphia is shooting their sixth and seventh free throws in the game. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. He makes one of two that time. Milwaukee leading by five. Seven foot shot, and there are the Bucks with another bucket. And so Curry will bring it up for Philadelphia. Passes to Maxi. In the corner, it's Harris. Now, here's Maxi. He has seven. Bucket six. Back to Harris. Three corners off the mark. And they hold a huge advantage on the back door. Allen dishes to Holiday. Here's Lopez. He can't get it to go. Good D by Embiid. Outside Kirk. Embiid against Lopez. And it's Brooke Lopez with the foul. That will get him his fourth foul of the game. Personal and that's his fourth, and no doubt he would have liked to have not gotten it this soon. And the Bucks making a change here. Wara checked in. Then for the 76ers, Shake Milton comes in for Curry, and Simmons subbed in for Maxi. Portis against Embiid, kicks to Green. Down to five on the shot clock. Fades, and he sinks that one in the back of the rim on the way in. And Bede's got 16. What a great play. Totally schooled the defender on that one. Allen outside, but free. It's hauled in by the 76ers. And Bede's got his sixth rebound on the night. And it's Harris off the drive. And it's rebounded by Drew Holland. Bucks leading by five. Here's Connaughton. Shoots. And again, the Bucks miss. And guys, not sure where his head was on that shot. Not what this offense was designed to create. Come on, you can't be selfish. You gotta be willing to make the next pass. Otherwise, it's just predictable. That is just a careless turnover. You've got to be smarter in those exchanges. And some changes here for the 76ers. Drummond's checked in for Joel Embiid. And it's George Niang in for Green. And so it's Milwaukee with it. Leading by five. Holiday, the pass to Connaughton. Allen outside. A three-pointer, no good. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Here's Norrell, guarded by Harris. 
Portis gets to Holiday. And Holiday throws it down. And, and Holiday's nimbleness gets him to the hoop on that one. His athletic ability is off the charts. Pass to Harris. A rebound by the Bucks. Here's Norrell. Seven points in the game, and the shot goes in. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. On the night, he's gone two for two at the strike. Chris Middleton's checked in for Milwaukee. And Philadelphia also making a switch. Ibles checked in. At the line for the Bucks. What's up? Jordan Mora. At the line for Warren. The 76ers trail by 10. Outside, Simmons. And the pass to Thibault. Now, here's Milton. Tight defense on him. And he uses the glass on the lane. He's got 12 in the game. Milwaukee's gone past the three-point line for 13 of their shots. Six of 13. Allen outside. Holiday from down in the low post, it goes. Holiday's got the lead back up to 10 now for the Bucks. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. The Simmons. And they double up Simmons. Four on the clock. going to be a 24-second shot clock violation. They turn it over. The 76ers making a switch here. Reed's checked in. Coming out of the floor for the 76ers. Paul Reed. Milwaukee leading by 10. Holiday with it. He's got 11. Middleton outside. Pass to Nora. Over Reed. With the tip. Portis on the follow Portis has got the lead up to 12 now for the Bucks, And a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far. Reed kicks to Simmons. Feeds to Drummond. And Drummond throws it down. This is what a point guard should do. Simmons is so adept at noticing when the defense is overcommitted. Allen passes to Middleton. Passes it to Holiday. Fires the three. And it's Reed pulling it down. The 76ers trail by 10. On the wing, Milton. Defended by Allen. Nifty move. That one falls. Drummond's got eight. Oh, this is why they get Drummond the ball there, because he's skilled at finishing. Two minutes. Two minutes. Reed. Holiday, the pass to Nora. Right side, Portis. In the corner, Middleton with it. Six on the shot clock. Over Theibel. And it's off the back rim. No good. Philadelphia's gotten one of six three-pointers to drop since coming out of the locker room at halftime. Rebounded by the Bucks. They've held a 12-point lead early. And Holiday has it in the corner. Over Simmons. The shot by Holiday, no good. The 76ers trail by eight. On the wing, Milton. Defended by Allen. Milton's shot is good. Milton's got four points in the quarter. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Timeout called the Bucks. Yeah, things not going their way, and he wants to just try to talk this one over. But the defensive intensity has to pick up, and I'm sure Coach is going to let them know that.
some changes here for the Bucks. Down is under the Kumbo, comes in for Portis, and Hood subbed in for Allen. One ten left in the third quarter. Outside, out of the Kumbo. Hood on the wing. He feeds it to Middleton. Over Thibel. And misses it off the right side of the rim. The 76ers trail by six. Outside, Simmons. Knocks it loose. Holiday with it. I'm guarded by Simmons. To stop the drought. And Holiday with a nice bucket inside. Holiday's got nine points in the quarter. He's been a different player since halftime. Come on, strong. And the foul on Drew Holiday. That's his fifth foul. That's number five of them. No room for error anymore. I bet they'll take it at him right now. Try to get him out the game. Dante DiVincenzo. He's checked in for Milwaukee. And the 76ers also making a change. Curry's checked in for Shake Milton. Twenty-nine seconds left in the third. Up top, Simmons. Under the Kumbo, defending. Simmons dishes to Drummond. Five on the clock. Here's Curry. And they call the foul, so a chance at the line for one more coming up. What a play there. The hoop plus the harm. He shot two free throws in the game. Made one and missed one. Seth Curry. One shot. Free throw drops for Curry. Drummond working against Giannis. Takes a three. Doesn't get it to drop for him. Chris Middleton has been on display for the Milwaukee Bucks. He delivered nine points from three-point range that quarter. Terrific work from distance. And we'll be back with you shortly. Let's take now this moment to bring up our State Farm assist of the game. And he sliced the D wide open with this feed. They had no chance to prevent that basket. No, that's quick decision making. You see a guy open, you can't hesitate. That's an outstanding play right there. And we're with you again as our round one coverage continues. The big men on the floor, Giannis and Lopez. At the guard positions, Holiday and DiVincenzo. And it's Hood in at the three spot. That's the group for Milwaukee right now. Good on the three-point shot. Curry. Curry's got the fourth quarter going with the first basket of the period here for Philadelphia. On the Dacumbo against Drummond. Back to DiVincenzo. Reed with the steal. Pass it to Simmons. Count it and the foul. Holiday. And so he's picked up his final foul. So he will sit for the rest of this game. Chris Middleton's checked in for Drew Holiday. Maxie's checked in for the 76ers. One misses. Milwaukee has gotten a three-point bug tonight. They've taken 15 shots outside the arc. Six of 15. Simmons against DiVincenzo. Pass to Giannis. 
It's tipped. Here's Lopez. It's Drummond with the rebound. Drummond's got his fourth rebound in this one. Here's Simmons to take the lead, and he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. And Drummond is a huge, powerful presence on the block. He has no problem getting physical down low. Andre Drummond taking two shots. No good on that one. Oh, come, on, come on, this guy is a walking nightly double double threat. <laughs> Andre Drummond's bruising power on both ends really makes an impact. Catching up on the changes for Philadelphia. Joel Embiid, he's checked in for Reed, and it's Green in for Simmons. And that trip coming up empty, missing both. The Bucks shooting at 51%, really so. Even Genzo against Curry. And the Bucks miss again. Now you can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. You're exactly right. That's the kind of shot they're trying to work for at the offensive. And that's right in his wheelhouse, looking to make an impact when it counts. This is why they go to him in these spots. I mean, they trust his judgment and ability to score down the stretch. The pass to Giannis. And a wide open look for Hood. No good. They had a chance to end the run there. If you can't hit that one, your teammates are going to think twice about feeding you the next time. Curry against DiVincenzo. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. DiVincenzo. That's his first personal foul. Third team foul. All right, well, a look at how the points have been generated so far. Scoring breakdown for the 76ers. I love how they've attacked the basket in this game. They've taken a very aggressive approach. Yeah, but, but they also never seem to get cold from mid-range. Just kept hitting those shots with consistency. First one falls for him. Harris has checked in for the 76ers. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Bucks trail by four. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Timeout called the Bucks. Joel Embiid with a strong contribution in this one. And he has absolutely worn them out in the paint. They, they need to come up with a plan to limit his touches in the interior. Let's go down to David Aldridge for a report from the sideline. Hey, guys, I was able to listen to what Mike Boldenholzer told his team during that timeout. His emphasis was for more effort on the defensive end. He said we have to do a better job of communicating and helping each other out. We're getting too many easy looks. Let's make it hard on them. Kevin, they're going to have to if they're going to slow down the hot shooting of their opponent. Okay, David, thanks. Tobias Harris. That's his third personal foul. First team foul. 
At the line for the box, Giannis Antetokounmpo. Shooting the legs. one. Find the legs. One shot. Free throw, good. Giannis. In 2020, a special year for Giannis, winning MVP and Defensive Player of the Year, then signing a Supermax extension worth over $200 million. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Green. An outstanding defensive play to earn the Mobile One block. And that block was something. It's the playoffs, and every possession and defensive stop matters. And here's Middleton bringing it up now for the Milwaukee Bucks. DiVincenzo kicks to Lopez. He committed just one turnover in the first half, and now it seems like they just keep on coming. He's got to get a handle on that ball. And still early in the period, and they're only one foul away from being over the limit. The 76ers have gone three of four in field goal attempts since getting things started here in the fourth. High post, Embiid. Lopez is there. Oh, pretty early to be over the limit. That foul situation is something we want to keep an eye on. Back the line for the 76ers. Tyrese Maxi. Back the line for two. They throw good, Maxi. He's perfect from the line this time. Just over two and a half minutes played now here in the final quarter of regulation. Hood, the pass to Middleton over Green. Milwaukee, no good that time either. The 76ers leading by three. This is to Harris. Curry on the wing. Defended by DiVincenzo. The offensive rebound. Out to Harris. The 76ers again can't hit it. Oh, the defense with no impact at all. Just didn't have the feel for his jump shot. Middleton on the wing. Hunted by Green. Here's on to Takumbo. Hood for three. Nailed from three-point lead. Hood's got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Philadelphia's gone one or two from three-point range here in the fourth. Quarter of play and over three and a half minutes have gone by. There's Embiid and it's sent back by Lopez. And having to be careful around Lopez. He's solid at time when he leap up to block shots. Everything looked good until the finish. And it all goes wrong. And Curry, here we go. And that one, good. Curry. And the 76ers lead by two. And that's an example of playing big, adapting to the situation. Well, you have a difficult finish, but if you expected him to back down, you better think again. Middleton, the pass to DiVincenzo. And no good. Had a chance to take the lead there. And not his best day from three-point line. He just won in the first half and still looking for his first here in half number two. That's to Curry. Clock at six. Here's MP and a great assist by Curry as that one goes in. Curry's got his third assist on the night. Hood, the pass to Giannis. And they double up Giannis. The kick out to Lopez. Shoots over MP. Here's Giannis. And Giannis on the Kumbo throws it down home. And with his length and explosiveness, it is never a surprise to see Giannis get points on the offensive glass. Great nose for the ball. And there's the feed to Harris. For Middleton. 
Harris misses. He'll breathe a big sigh of relief if they hang on to win this game. He's not done much to contribute to it. Even Genzo against Curry. Good. No good there. Now the 76ers take it the other way. Inside. Here's Embiid. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Lopez. And so he's picked up his final foul. And he will sit for the rest of this game. Milwaukee making a switch here. Portis is checked in. Embiid taking two shots. First one falls. And MB drops them both. And the Bucks with possession here. Four point game. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, that, their offense has ground to a standstill. Middleton can't get it to go. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. This is a good even Genzo. Trying to break that ice cold streak. And a great assist by Adabakumbo as that one goes in. For Philadelphia, they've gone 5 of 10, 50% from the field. And here's Maxi. Now Harris. Outside Curry. Launches it. It's rebounded by Portis. Portis has got five rebounds tonight. Here's Middleton. He nails it. And we're tied up. Middleton's got 25 points. Nice. A mid-range jumper by Middleton. I didn't know guys were allowed to take that shot anymore. Now, here's Maxi. And there's the call on Joel Embiid. That's his first foul. His first personal foul. First team foul. Milwaukee's gotten just one of four three-pointers to go down for them here in the fourth. Here's onto Takumbo, and the rejection by Embiid. Awesome timing on the rejection. Embiid, the big fella. You don't want to bring it in around this guy. Here's Middleton. Pass to onto Takumbo. Down low. Here's Portis. And a great assist by Andacumbo as that one goes in. And the Bucks lead by two. Here's Max. Driving the lane. That one good for two. Maxie's got 11 points here in just the second half. Strange game for him. Barely made any noise in the first half. And here in the second, he's been everywhere. Even Chenzo passes to Giannis. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Embiid's got 10 rebounds here tonight. It's so active. Stolen by Middleton. Outside Hood. An amazing finish with a hand right in his face. Hood's got five points now this quarter. Making the defense feel helpless. I mean, when Hood stays locked in, he's still the score. Now, here's Maxi. By Hood. Inside. Here's Curry. Even Chenzo with the rebound. Milwaukee in the lead. Now the pass to on the Kumbo. And a wide open look for Portis. Knocks down the three ball. Not shy from outside. There, there's no doubt about that. Spreading the floor and hitting them up. Outside Curry. Here's Embiid. Good on the 13-footer. Embiid's got 22 points. 
I like seeing him beat rise to the occasion. He knows how to capitalize during important stretches of games. Outside hood. Pass to Middleton. Shot clock at five. Rebound by the 76ers. Harris has got his fourth rebound in this one. The dish to Kerr. Scores the bucket. He's seven for 11 and continues to look good. And guys, all about hard work from this point on. They worked hard to create that high quality shot and then able to knock it down. For three, Middleton. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. And I thought that was going to drop. It looked good from here. Did a combo against Harris. Curry on the wing. Embiid finds Curry. Oh, and they take the lead. Curry's got a couple of three-pointers now in the fourth for Philadelphia. Yeah, he continues to improve as a passer. The sky's the limit for Embiid and his own crowd. Now to Hood, shot to stop the run. And Embiid pulls it down. The 76ers lead. Here's Harris. Some solid defense from Andre Kumbo. And so Giannis will bring it up for the Bucks. Here's DiVincenzo. That's all good, and that's his fifth basket of the game. He's shooting five for 11 now. And you can feel the crowd react as one. Guys, what a blast of energy that just sent through this entire building. To the paint. Harris against Giannis. Harris passes to Embiid. Back to Harris. And you can't get a bigger bucket than that. That's why they put the ball in his hands. They know they can count on one big shots. Now a timeout called by Milwaukee. They're down by two. There's 53 seconds left to play here in the fourth. present our New Balance player of the game, Joel Embiid. And he's just been crushing it from the field tonight, Kevin. Whether it's been on open looks or with the guy draped all over him, he just hadn't missed much. With his percentage in the sky-high range, they've had no choice but to make him their number one option on every trip. Fifty-three seconds left in the fourth quarter, and the whistle blows on the backcourt violation. He went over and back. And, and you can tolerate gas like that sometimes, but in a close game, man, I tell you what, that really hurts. Milwaukee making a switch. Wara checked in. Now here's Maxi. By Hood passes to Harris. Outside for Curry. Pass to Maxi. Five to shoot to the inside. There's Embiid. It drops. Yeah, what I love about the big man is his fearlessness. I mean, Embiid, he's a leader. He feels comfortable taking big shots. Timeout called the Bucks. 
They're trailing by four. 29 seconds left in the fourth. Good. Finds DiVincenzo. Bucks passing it around. Mora. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. That's his second personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for the Bucks. Jordan Mora. At the line for two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. He drops the first one, and that narrows the lead down to just three. And so he makes both from the line. And now you're in a great position thanks to those clutch free throws. One possession game now. And that's an intentional foul. No choice but to foul there, but, but he's probably the last guy you want to see. Shooting for Philadelphia. Tyrese Patsy. Two shots. So the first one drops, and that makes it a three-point lead. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a four-point ball game. Two-possession game now. I mean, those were really important foul shots. The pass to Antetokounmpo. Hood for three. Count it! And what a sensational bucket to bring them within one. Ice in his veins. He loves having a chance to come up big for a squad. And now they foul and stop the clock. That, that's right. No other option but to foul. And go for some misses. Going to the 76ers. Seth Curry taking two shots. the first and that will put them up by two and he hits both free throws here so now it's a three-point game comes through big now they can put everything they have into guard against the team. and it's all about the three right here and that's what they need to tie it boy what a game this has been and this is why he gets paid the big bucks. Middleton enjoys coming through in the clutch. Timeout called the 76ers. It's tied at 114. Five seconds left in the fourth quarter.
And here's Maxi. And that's going to do it for regulation. So we are headed to overtime. And we'll get going after this from Milwaukee. Well, four quarters were enough to decide this ballgame. Sit back and enjoy as we move on to overtime. Tip-off goes to Milwaukee. And always a good ride in these post-regulation battles. This overtime now looking to be an exciting one. All fueled up and ready to go to overtime basketball here. Brought to us by Gatorade. Let's check out who's on the floor. So on the floor for Philadelphia. Front court filled in by Green at three and Harris at the four. Maxi out there with Curry. And it's Embiid in at the five, roaming the paint. Even Shenzo can't hit it. 76ers shooting a tremendous 61% from the floor, hitting at all cylinders. And the paint. And the rejection by Giannis. In the corner, Middleton with it. The Bucs working the ball around. Allen surveying the D. And the wide open shot from DiVincenzo. Sinks the three-pointer. DiVincenzo's got the first basket here in overtime for the Bucs. Now, here's Maxi, Defended by Middleton. Harris dishes to Green. Six on the shot clock. Curry outside. Rebound, Milwaukee. Juarez got five rebounds tonight. We're in overtime and 90 seconds gone here in what has been a great one so far. Harris against out of the Kumbo. Allen outside. The putback. Great positioning on the putback. Now it's a five-point Bucks lead. That is really good work there on the offensive glass. Curry against DiVincenzo. Curry passes to Embiid. And the wide open shot from Green. Drills it from outside. Oh, when the team needs a bucket, Green steps up. I mean, ready to deliver assertive shooting and keep them on the track. Loads it up for Giannis. Takes the alley you pass and dunks it down. And you know, he knows. He's the leader of this team, Giannis. Embracing the opportunity to come through with big baskets. Pass to Embiid. Here's Maxi. Not as good off the bat rim and in. It's been like this all night for both teams. The offenses having their way. Yeah, but defensively, neither side has been able to adjust, and that's reflected in the score. Portis, who's checked in for Milwaukee. Hood comes in for Grayson Allen. Bumps pass from Hood for a three. Middleton. Here's Giannis. A second chance effort. Portis trying to free himself. That's a break for the D right there. I mean, he takes advantage of open looks inside more often than not. Curry passes to Maxi. Back to Curry. Just five to shoot. To tie it up. And the rejection by Giannis. Overtime basketball, a little under three and a half minutes into it. And he drives in, and Andre Jacumbo slams it in. Watch out. Andre Jacumbo might be soft-spoken, but he's got a mean streak when it comes to attacking the hoop. Passes it to Harris. Pass to Maxi. Another 
first shot. And Harris lays it up and in. Just incredible patience by Harris. Rising to the occasion in a big way with the key basket there. Even Genzo with it. Here's Giannis. And they double up Giannis. Good. Fires for three. Trifecta. He's moving because of good. Loves having the ball in his hands. And his team needs a ball. And Philadelphia calls time here. They trail by five. 51 seconds left in the first overtime. Checked in for the Bucks. Now Harris. Outside Green. Stolen by Middleton. And now the fast break. Middleton with the ball. So they foul intentional. Fortunabe checked in for Shemi Ojale. Substitution for your box. Passes to Watsonabe. Giannis outside. On the wing, Di Vincenzo. And again, another assist. That makes 15 assists. He's been one step ahead of the defense all game long. And Philadelphia calls time here. They're behind by seven. 29 seconds left to play in OT, and this battle continuing. its way from Curry for two. It's in! Oh, and that cuts the lead to just five. And you can tell they had that play ready to go. Well done on the inbound. And now we've got the intentional foul. Personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for Milwaukee, Dante DiVincenzo. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And that hurts as he doesn't get the first one to fall. Trying to focus now on the second. And the Bucks making a change here. Onto the Kumbos checked in. He's able to hit the second one, and that increases their lead to six. And here are the 76ers now. Just two seconds between shot clock and game clock. To the middle. Here's Harris. It counts. And now they trail by just four. 
And, and when you're Harris's size, you have to really use your length to beat defenders, and he is just Curry. so good at doing that. His second personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for Milwaukee, Dante DiVincenzo. Shoot two. two shots. And he cannot get the first one to drop. Tough one to miss. And the second of two is good. That puts them up by five. And here's Curry who brings it up for the Philadelphia 76ers. The tray. And Chris Middleton pulls it down. And he commits the intentional foul. foul. Tobias Harris. That's his fourth personal foul. Fourth team foul. At the line for Milwaukee. Take a break. Take a break. At the line for the shoot. First free throw is good, and that increases their lead to six. An already proven score. Who needs to keep adding to his game, specifically focusing on becoming a better all-around versatile player? And so both free throws are good, and it's a seven-point game. And they've been a different team here in overtime. They just seem to have lost their energy. So it's Milwaukee picking up the win. Just a massive victory, Greg. Maybe it's overstating it, but I think this was a game they had to have. And I don't think it's overstating it. I agree with you. I mean, going down 2-0 would have given this team a huge hill to climb. But now at one game apiece and with some momentum, this is anybody's series. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much. Giannis, you have said in the past you have even more untapped potential. So how did you put your fingerprints on this game? I'm just here to do whatever it takes to help my team win. Did a great job executing, moving the ball. And uh, this is what we do. This is what we do. We play together and uh, whatever we do, hopefully we can get a win at the end of the day. Well, it certainly turned into a win tonight, man. Thanks. Back to you guys. All right, David, thank you. And that about wraps it up for this broadcast of the...